video, I want to tell you about something called domain grabbing and how to prevent it. First of all, what's domain grabbing? It's some, sometimes this happens, doesn't happen all the time, but let's say you search for a domain in some domain registrar, re, registrar place, and then you come back to it later and it's bought, it's taken, and it's stolen from you. Because there are people who spy on domain searches and then buy up good domains and then squat on them and just keep them so that you would want to buy them from the domains from them. So it's a negative tactic. And the way to prevent this for and, and a lot of domain registrars like GoDaddy, they they participate with them. So and they're one of the worst offenders in working with domain grabbers. And by the way, a lot of the examples in this course use GoDaddy. That's just to use an example. In your case, what I would recommend is the online, what's considered to be a safe place is this instantdomainsearch.com. And what you want to do, the way to use this, do not, like for example, when you search a domain, if I say like test, obviously it shows you that it's not taken. But if I say ABC, it's, it shows you what's taken and it shows you what's available and for how much. And then if I put some gibberish, obviously that's not going to be taken. And you can even buy this for 99 cents, which is very cheap. And then what, what you want to do, you only want to buy, it's going to actually take you to GoDaddy, but you never want to click this until you're ready to buy. And that way you won't get your domain name grabbed. Now, in my case, whenever I've looked for domains, I've never had it stolen. But a student in this course brought up the possibility that it could be stolen. So now I'm making this video just to make sure, like, do not search on GoDaddy. This course just uses GoDaddy as an example, but there's a million places that are that, that you can search using. But I recommend this one because it's considered to be safe if you don't actually until you click buy and only click buy until you're ready. And prior to that, basically it, you just it just it updates as you go, so you don't have to click anything. You can look at the, the results that it shows you. And in my opinion, the fear of these domain grabbers is a little bit overblown, but just to be safe, you use instant domain search and I'll have the URL to this website in the resources section of this video so that you can go there and use this for your domain research only.